Okay, um, in this video, I'm going to show you how to upgrade your Asus EEE PC 900A. Um, I just picked up a brand new memory, uh, 2 gig DDR2 SODIMM uh, from Newegg. Um, Newegg is really a great place to get your computer stuff. So. Also, I've uh, picked up a, a 16 gig uh, SDHC uh, card right there. So what we're going to do is um, open up the back. Um, it's only two screws, so get a little screwdriver because the screws are tiny. And make sure you remove the battery. Um, there's two locks on the side of the battery, so make sure you unlock them and pull it out. <coughs> Now that the screws are gone, you can just uh, pretty much open the panel. And what you'll find inside is the memory and the SSD hard drive right above it. Um, the memory is held uh, by two latches, one on each side, left and right. So I just use a screwdriver to um, unlock the latches. And it pops right back up. And pull it out. Easy as that. That's the uh, old memory. So, and on the left, it's the new memory, the right, it's the old memory. Um, and you pretty much should just do the same thing, pop it back in place, uh, make sure it's uh, securely in there, um, and push it down, and the latch will lock it back in. That's it, you have new memory in there. Now you put the uh, cover back on. Uh, make sure the holes are facing or right above the uh, screw holes. Um, there's little uh, plastic things sticking out of this panel. Um, so make sure those are popped in and it'll just fall right back in. Screw it back on. Now put the battery back in. All you have to do is uh, slide it in place. Make sure you lock it. By the way, only one of the locks actually slide to lock. The other one um, snaps back in. So you just have to lock one. The other one's always in a locking position. Turn it back on. So it's now booting up. Um, I'm going to show you one way to check to see if your um, memory is being recognized. And, I mean, if you get this far in, it should have recognized it, or else you wouldn't be able to get this far. Um, in Easy Peasy Ubuntu, um, all you have to go is, do is go to the um, administrator section. And you do um, one of the uh, system 
system applications. And it'll show you like your processor, hard drive space, um, OS version, and it'll also show you your um, memory size. Kind of blurry there, but it's recognizing it, recognizing it as a two gig, and that's it.